It's a beautiful day to get out on a boat, and that's exactly where we find storm teammate meteorologist Sarah Flynn, who is on the Thorn Apple River. How are things going, Sarah? Hey, Brittany, yeah, we are two for two for nice beach and boating forecast. Last Thursday filled with blue skies and today really no different out here. It was a cooler start to our morning, but temperatures on the rise this afternoon. And luckily it is an accurate reflection of what our weekend will be like this go around. Take a look at some of our cameras across the region. A little bit breezy and seeing some of those waves get kicked up, but overall a pretty calm day, especially compared to where we have been the last couple of days. Nothing but sunshine in the vicinity again, blue sky carrying through. Looking at the UV index, both today and tomorrow, actually relatively high for this time of the year. We're sitting between about a 7 and 8, which again puts us between uh, that high and very high. Keep in mind, you can get a sunburn in anywhere from 5 to 10 minutes on unprotected surfaces. And Friday will actually be a pretty pleasant day as well. We'll see high temperatures towards the lakeshore topping off near 70 under mostly sunny skies. Now, some changes as we move towards the weekend. Saturday will be a bit cooler. We'll see highs at the lakeshore in those mid 60s, although inland will be more pleasant. We'll be sitting in those low to mid 70s, but we do have a chance for scattered showers no matter where you are. It's not going to be a complete washout by any means, but definitely a bit more cloud cover in the vicinity because of it. And those winds will pick up ever so slightly from the south turning to the southwest, and that'll kick up your wave heights at about one to three feet. So even though it'll be a bit of a dreary day, expect those yellow flags to be flying. Sunday, though, I think is the best day of the weekend. Mid 70s at the lakeshore, those winds coming from the west, wave heights pretty calm as well only up to about a foot now I also want to touch on water levels this was a big topic of conversation last year Lake Michigan actually up five inches from where we were last month but comparison to last year we're actually down we had some record water levels in the vicinity last year and if we compare it to average still well above average and even the projections expected them to rise over the next couple of weeks but no concerns about that just yet in fact the pattern a fairly dry stretch here as we move towards the weekend even those showers that I mentioned on Saturday going to be fairly, fairly minor, not a whole lot of accumulation expected to come from those. And into next week, we'll be talking 80s. I think our beach and boating forecasts will only get better from here on out. But enjoy today. Enjoy tomorrow. We should have blue skies in the vicinity. We are live on the Thornapple River in Ada. I'll send it back to you, Brittany.